Hi everyone! みなさん、こんにちは。これは今週の新しいビデオです。This is this week's new video. いきます !Let's go! So, I know it's already been a week since the Olympics ended, but why not keep celebrating the athletes' amazing accomplishments with more speed paints? So, this is part one of two speed paints inspired by this photo over here by Japan's surfboarding silver medalist Igarashi Kanao. During the opening ceremony with skateboarding gold medalist Hori Ome Yuto. First, after the basic shapes, I am now putting in the facial expressions. So, one thing I've tried to do differently is adding in those facial features、um, after my basic shapes because when I was doing traditional sketches, I realized that my eye placement was very incorrect. So, to prevent that from happening, here's what I'm doing now. Previously, what you just saw is I really wanted to get this drawing in before the Olympics finished. So I tried to rush in straight into the details, the, the blazer, the dress shirt. However, I found out that that did not quite work. So I am currently doing what I like to call Basic Shapes 2.0, which is kind of like the、uh, triangles for the upper body, where the shoulders are, and where the muscles, muscle placement for the arms are. So, after doing that for Reiki, I'm currently doing it on Langa. <laughs> Sorry about that, I forgot to mention. But what I was doing is I'm drawing Reiki and Langa, so the two skateboarders or main skateboarders from the anime, Skate the Infinity, as Horigome and Igarashi. So, after some thought, I decided that I would do two separate pieces for each character slash person, depending on how we're seeing this. And then I would kind of mash them together to create that final opening ceremony photo that Igarashi put on. So after I do my Basic Shapes 2.0, I am now doing my details and it is a lot easier. I can actually have my placements correct.、Um, and one thing that I usually mess up is the shoulders. So I usually make them too skinny. So with that extra Basic Shape 2.0, that really helps me out there. Currently, doing the fingers. I'm not gonna lie, Igarashi's、um, hand for the fo- for the. Sorry, Igarashi's hand where he's holding up the peace sign looked a bit awkward. It may have just been the angle. So I had some trouble doing i r a k i s hand over there like that. And that was just me adjusting the areas. Instead of redoing the whole sketch, I kind of take duplicate my sketch, area, sketch layer, move it around to make sure it fits what I want it to be. So, I can get the perfect line art. Although my line art is far from perfect, there's still a lot of things I'm planning to change about it and improve. And after seeing some posts, what I'm currently doing is not the background, but kind of like the Olympic rankings or like medalist placements, kind of what that is there. So, originally, I was just going to use the actual ones used in the Olympics. However, I realized it would be easier just to make my own, so I used it from the own colors there. And I'm currently just filling in the little white spots that I couldn't see. And now I am doing the shadows after finishing my base colors. So, although the dress shirt is more of a white in the pictures, I kind of picked a color. Ooh, sorry. I picked a color that was closer to the blazer. That would be like a lighter color, so it's not pure white because then it would be hard to do highlights. And finally, added in the line art for the breast pocket with the handkerchief in it. Not quite sure why I didn't do that before, but, but bam, here it is now.、Uh, one thing I did notice is that when I took a photo of my iPad while I was doing the piece, there's something missing between like the two fingers holding up the piece sign. Like you can see, like It looks like some of the meat, or not meat, the muscle or like part of the finger is missing. So, I guess a quick little tip for that is take photos of your digital art and kind of look at it and see what's missing. Added in the amazing blue and brightly colored pattern on the handkerchief. And finally, going over the piece, looking for any places where I need to put in some more highlights or shadows. And with that, I'm getting into putting in the Olympic standing kind of ceremony. Not ceremony, but like ranking kind of thing with、uh, Reki's name, the sport, and the event they're competing in. Putting in a quick little background, and with that, we are done the piece.